Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Perfect Angle. Alright, we uh, last went through and uh, where he says, uh, something, I think he says like an oak tree or something like that, and over time he's been, you know, getting old and whatnot. So let's see if we can do 31, 2, 3 and get to this remember. Depending on how fast we may keep going, but let's see what happens with number 31. Alright, another one of these guys here, with the, uh, looks like, um, be a chain link. I'm gonna just kind of flip automatically, because that was something that first just came into my head. Wait a minute. The other thing I didn't notice until I watched back the last video was, um, the clothespin was right there. And, uh, it was sort of, like, included in the way that this thing looked. Wow, shit, that's weird. Um, could be a weird ass bike. It could be a bike. Uh, so I'm kind of looking at both shapes right now. The one that's uh, right here on the right, as well as the one that's on the shadow, because uh, it was a dead giveaway that that uh, clothespin was there, but didn't actually see it until uh, it was on the screen. What the hell could this be? Mm, this looks like a guy skiing or skateboarding or kicking someone down the stairs. <laughs> oh boy, that took a real dark turn. Let's see what this one does. We'll go back to the original. So I have a feeling it might be like where this is kind of pointed towards the light. So more this way, I guess. Like this. Like all bunched together. Might actually turn into be something, but it doesn't appear to be that way. Oh uh, wow. This is a strange one. Well, I hope you guys are still enjoying this. Um, I saw the previous one before this did really well, and I hope that means that this is starting to take off, because it is really cool just to kind of, like I said, when you look at a cloud with a group of friends and uh, you say, hey, look, a bus, and somebody's like, a bus? I see an old man, or I, I see... Uh, um, Whatever. But it's everybody has something different based on the perspective of uh, life or oh, is that something there? Almost looks like a guy in a toboggan or something. Uh, or their life experiences and stuff like that that uh, really decides what they see, you know. And that's the coolest thing I think about this is that it's like I wonder what other people see when they look at this. And compared to what I'm seeing, like I said, it looks like, you know, it looks like somebody doing this and that and then kicking someone downstairs. It's, I wonder if anybody would have ever gone that dark. I've never been kicked down the stairs myself, but, or had any bad experiences with stairs. I've tripped up them a few times and down them, but nothing that's ever been, you know, traumatizing or anything. Are we getting somewhere with this? It's like a shoe. Like two feet walking like an elf shoe or something. <laughs> wow, I am I have no idea what this could be. Let's speed this up and I'll bring you guys back once I get uh, a little bit more of an idea of what the hell this is. Alright guys, I've got the start of something here. Like it looks... what the hell? This looks like it would be something like a weed whipper or... But I can't get the perfect angle. <laughs> um, there's gotta 
be something here, because the other ones, I've been farting around with those for a while, and they don't look like much of anything, so this is the only one that really made any sense. Um, but I'm having a hell of a time trying to get this to settle in in the right spot. What I'm trying to do is to turn it, not this way, not that, well, well, maybe that way, but see, like, this needs to make a circle. There! What the hell is that? Oh, a key! Oh, okay. Um, I was thinking Weed Whipper, but alright. <laughs> I guess that works. Okay. This was nice. That took me, I don't know, probably about eight minutes off site. Oh, cool, a water one. What the hell? Oh cool, you can go underwater. That's a ship. You can tell by the little basket on top. That thing right there. Um, okay, so you gotta be in the water. How do we get these pieces to line up? How do we... Wow, that's a... A strange looking ship. <laughs> Okay, wait, from this side. Nope. Uh, nope, that won't work. So it has to be right here. Here it is. Oh, yeah. Come on, line up. Don't be a dick. How is that not a thing? to be it. It was just the, the back end was all messed up. Sorry, when you go back down here, uh, where the hell was it now? Right here. See, everything else lines up, but it's this area. That's a weird looking ship. Okay, I, I get it. I get it. Oh, you got missiles. Oh, okay. So here, let's do that. I didn't even see those missiles up there. Okay, so now if we go back here... Will you work? How, how is that not a thing? So what is it that's messing it up? Let's see... You need this... you need this middle one. You need the end one. That one there, I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I think you would need it. Kind of looks like this one here would be gone. So let's get rid of that one and see if that makes a difference. Because where I'm at, I've got the right angle, but... Or I've got the perfect angle. There it is. Yay! I told you it was a ship. Woo-hoo. Let's see what kind of good is. We're getting the hang of this one now. Oh, down the drain. Very, very cool. I've always liked the little transitions that they've got on here. Ooh. What the hell is this? Maybe lining them up? What if I line up yellow to yellow? No, I can't do green to green. See, try doing red to red. Ooh, I wonder if it has to do with music. The thing in the background there. up here. Nope, that doesn't seem to be it. I think it's got something to do with this. Well, I think it does. It's in 
trying to uh, like line up the different colored balls to see if they make uh, a thing. <laughs> you like that scientific term, huh? Um, and see, I'm thinking like if you cover up certain ones, maybe it'll make it do something else or it's not there. See these change direction. The hell is that? Oh, one of those thingies you see in the psychiatrist's office. Make them look smart. Emotions. My memories are an encounter between my mind and my emotions. I want you to know everything, that you understand everything. Oh, wow. Interesting. So let's see what happens here. Moving along, moving along. Uh, let's just do a wild guess right off the top. I'll say a Victrola. That's an old record player that you had to wind up. But, um... Uh, Conch. What the hell is the name of that book with the uh, the kids that were on that uh, stranded island? Uh, had the kid Pig Piggy on it, and it killed them, and it pushed a rock off the cliff. I can't remember the name of that book. Looks like uh, an eye. An eyebrow? <laughs> banana! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank God it's a banana, not something else. Ooh, level 34. We're gonna go on to 36, I guess? Yeah. Let's move on to the next one. Oh, I thought we would have had missiles that looked like something that would have had missiles. Is this a person? I don't see arms. Hmm. Very interesting. What the hell that is? That is a strange looking shape. I wonder how this will fit together. It's like a somebody holding a pot or something. See, I'm looking at this piece here. I'm trying to line that up so you can see how there's the gap right there, so if I go here, like right about there, I can't do anything from that angle, because it looks like uh, the top of something, like an umbrella, or I don't know what that would be. Spin around on the side quickly. Is that a chess piece? Very intriguing. Oh, look, looks like a top of a pop bottle. How would that even fit in? What the hell? Oh, like a broken bottle, maybe. I think that's what that would be. But 
how do you piece that together? What I'm looking at now are these, this piece right here and this piece here, trying to line them up with something, but... Oh, are we, uh, are we on to something here? Piecing this together... very awkwardly, I'll say. <laughs> Holy jeez. Um, trying to line up pieces to see. Because it, it, to me, it's something broken. But what? I couldn't tell you. But it definitely looks like something broken. And it can't go any further that way. Hmm. Alright, for the sake of speeding up time, we'll bring you back. Once I get a little bit further in this, and we will have our answer. Okay, it was a blender, or a coffee pot, or whatever. <laughs> it wasn't anything broken at all. Those extra pieces, I tell you, they're just there to mess with you. Oh, another light one. Okay. We're usually pretty good at these. These are kind of hit and miss. It's either you got it or you don't. An apple. Eaten apple. Broken apple. <laughs> uh, a heart. A broken heart. Uh, there it is. I told you it was an apple. Alright, let's see what the story is this time. Time. Quiet nights. I don't know if I was remembering the future or just imagining it. It's all in the eye of the beholder. Is time linear or circular? Well, if you believe what they say, they say that history repeats itself, so that would necessarily mean that it's circular. And I got the achievement, the tree. I hope you guys are still enjoying this series. Uh, it's it's fun for me to play. I enjoy this. It's uh, one of those things you can kind of play it at any time of the day or night, and quite relaxing. Just like I said before, uh, if you are liking this, show it some love. Give me some thumbs up. Share it with your friends. Whatever you want to do. And uh, we're on our road to 200 subs. So the more people you can share it with, the better. I appreciate all of you. Thank you for the support, and I will see you in the next one. Take care. Thank you.